complete contrast to the complex workings of the signal school, let's introduce an entirely new conception of modeling, ideally named contemporary distractions. Besides giving us a new art form, distractions like this low tide harbor created by artist Sam Smith provide a new range of toys for grown-ups, which heaven knows we need in this age of tension. Hence the title, Distractions. Sam Smith's range is wide, yet without any attempt at realism, see how he recaptures the mood of his subject, who hasn't seen this girl before. Many of these working models are satirical in theme or have some light-hearted social significance. But a more serious theme is evident in this nativity scene, for example. The keynote of all, however, is the remarkable atmosphere he has achieved. Distractions, or three-dimensional cartoons, as they were first known, are made of everyday materials. Pieces of wood, old rope, waste paper, wood shavings, jet beads and buttons. Not that the models are just knocked up from bits and pieces. Often, several types of wood, carefully selected, are used in one object. While into all go an expert knowledge of art, of mechanics and of carpentry. Very simply titled, Reader Drinker, this distraction typifies the rather short-sighted gentleman we've all seen sitting in his favourite pub and peering at, well, the racing results perhaps. Another satirical glimpse of life as others live it is the woman and her cat exchanging confidences, which is incidentally the name of this set. However, the creations of Mr. Smith are essentially distractions. He feels that although toys for adults has been a neglected field, grown-ups are really easier to please than children. He can say that again. <laughs> 